body in the creek. Yeah. Chief Davis, Jack Porter's here to see you. Send him in. Hi, Jack Porter. It's a pleasure meeting you, Chief Davis. Times newspaper has hired me to do a story about the recent murder due to my specific qualifications. See, my aunt was a prostitute and she was murdered by her last customer. Is your department close to finding the killer? Well, this investigation is still in progress. I, I can't give you any details. What can you tell me about the murder? Material evidence is washed away in the rain. Those bodies have been laying out there for several days now. <laughs> we don't have any evidence. So uh, have the murders been committed by the same killer? Well, we, we look for patterns that prove the murders are the work of the same person. That helps us to solve the case faster. It must be frustrating for an officer to so to speak, run into such a dead end. Decon? Yes, it is. No wallet, no ID. We're guessing she's a hooker. My God. Won't be long before whoever murdered her will murder again. We got to catch him. The women's fear has caused them to suspect everyone and to give the investigators super abundance of tips. While trying to check them all, the homicide department has lost valuable time in the search for the real murderer. Hello? Good evening, Chief Davis. I hope this isn't a bad time. No. Were you able to get an ID on the victim? Yes, she's female, 23, and fingerprints identified her as Victoria Travis. She was reported missing five days ago. That also fits the time of death. What's the official cause of death? Same M.O. as the other girls? From the anatomic findings, her death was due to asphyxia as a consequence of strangulation. Dr. Reed, thank you for your call. How was your day? Still working on finding the lead to who's murdering these girls. The media is all over this thing. Somebody named Jack Porter came by my office today asking a bunch of questions. Jack Porter, do you know who that is? No. Porter is that guy who got a life sentence for murdering a woman 10 years ago. He was just released last year. 